Hey there guys, it's your boy Casanova here to share another banger and a deal that I couldn't pass that I found online and I want to share with you guys. As I mentioned in my last video, uh, I mostly do Spanish reviews, but I know I do have uh, subscribers that don't speak Spanish. So I'm, what I'm going to try to do going on forward it's I'm gonna if I do a review in Spanish, I'm gonna do my best to do a review in English also. Now the fragrance that I want to talk about today, it's from Memo Paris and it's called African Leather. And the reason why I'm doing this video is because the fragrance, if you go to their website, uh Memo Paris, the the fragrance is around three hundred dollars. Uh from 300 to 500, depending on the size, uh, they have a 2.5 and a 6.7. I think the 6.7 is like 550, I think. Um, now, uh, a lot of people that want to smell like niche colognes, are, they get scared because of the prices, right? But this is a clear example where, you know, you don't have to spend a lot of money to smell great and Thankfully, I'm here to help you guys because I do have a good job, but I do have a budget uh, on on how much I spend in my colognes uh, each month, each six months in a year, right? I mean, I, I'm not rich. I cannot. If I was rich, I would probably have <laughs> 10,000 bottles, right? Um, but I do have a solid collection, and there are things that... I test before I buy and then once there's things that I really like and I put them on a list and this is one of them that I really have had it on, on my list for a while uh, I just kind of ended up buying other things and the cologne that I'm gonna talk about is African leather now there's a website that I found that's called it the name is eat discounters eat discount perfumes.com Anyways, I'm gonna I'm gonna put the link uh, on the description, and um, you know I have bought several bottles from them. What I like about the website, they sell a lot of testers. They even sell like uh, damaged uh, fragrances, um, or sometimes they even sell fragrances without without a box, and they give good discounts. And I can assure you they're legit. Uh, but anyways, uh, so. I was just browsing, you know, like, hey, what they have, you know, because uh, they do have a, like a tester section, you know, a unisex section. And I ended up running into this right here, which is a travel size. And I saw that it was $65. Now, usually when travel sizes, it's usually a 5 ml or 10 ml decan uh, or whatever. So, you know, I was like, damn, for 10, 10 ml, 65 is kind of the pricey size. I had already gone through a 5 ml decan, and I really like the fragrance. I just, you know, like I said, um, I, I really ha haven't justified uh, myself to buy it yet. But then when I look at the description, I saw that it was 3 10 mls, which is what, an ounce. Now, nah, think about it. One ounce for $65. And they come out like this. This is the presentation. As you can see, I started wearing this one already. Um, the only thing I kind of don't like is that they don't come with a with a cap. Now the sprayer, it's pretty good. See that? Um, so yeah, when I saw that it was a, a ounce for sixty five dollars, I clicked on it real quick. Now. The shipping is free, so the only they only charge for taxes, which came out to seventy dollars even for one ounce of uh, African leather. Which to me, I mean, one ounce with the collection I have, I have close to four hundred bottles. If this is more than enough for a while, now for you guys, I don't know. You might want to the whole presentation. You know, you might want to have the bottle. To me, I care about the juice. I do like the presentation, but. At the end of the day, one ounce for seventy dollars. Think about it. If you were to get two of these, it would be two ounces for like one forty. So you're still below 
um, getting a tester, which, like I said, that's the testers I've seen around 180. I think I've seen them as low as 160 for a tester. So come on, one ounce for $65. Hey, couldn't pass. Now let's go back to what this smells like. This is a very good fragrance, man. This, you have to like cardamom, first of all. It's real spicy. It has saffron, cumin, vetiver, but it's so, it's so freaking sexy. It does have leather, but the leather is not really animalic. So if you're thinking, because the name might turn you off, like, hey, it's African leather. It's going to be a very animalic you know dirty uh fragrance it's not it's not at all if anything this is this is real sexy sophisticated oh my god i just love it uh it's not a bismo fragrance but it's no slouch either i mean i get solid six to eight hours now if you spray on your clothes that's a whole different Store. I mean, your clothes are gonna be smelling like African leather till you wash them. But yeah, guys, I really just kind of wanted to share uh, this 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 find this find that I that I found because I think it's a really good deal. I mean, for sixty five dollars, you can smell great, different than anybody. Think about it. You go to the mall and and you know you're looking at Invictus or or one million or blue dish, you know, you're gonna pay retail what eighty to a hundred dollars already. Blue dish is like one twenty. So for sixty five dollars, you can smell better than anybody else. I mean, don't get me wrong. I like Paco Rabanne. I like blue dish Chanel. I have them in my collection. They're really good, safe fragrances. But but when you want to stand out, you want to impress, you got stuff like this. I mean, this. Trust me, you go to a, I know, a party or, you know, hang out with your friends one night, you put this on, they're not going to smell like you. You're going to stand out. Anyways, I just wanted to share this, guys. Uh, if you like my, uh, my channel, please subscribe and like my video, okay? Thank you.